let's relate decimals to fractions using base 10 blocks. We can reference a place value chart to see how many hundredths are in 1 and 35 hundredths. This helps me see that there are 135 hundredths in this number. So if this represents 1 one hundredth, then I know that this can represent 100 one hundredths. And this stick can represent 10 hundredths. Now that I've assigned values to my base 10 blocks, let's go ahead and represent 135 hundredths. This model will help students visualize decimals as fractions. We will add two more tenths to make a total of 30 hundredths, and four more blocks for a total of 5 hundredths. Now my model is representing 135 hundredths. To write this as a mixed number, I know that 100 one hundredths equals one whole. And what I have left is 35 hundredths. So we can relate this decimal to 135 hundredths or 1 and 35 hundredths.